At your personal best training studio, many of our clients enjoy working in small groups of two to four people called semis. These workouts are typically divided into 20 minute segments and they run from 30 minutes to one hour. Workout week one focuses on building stamina, strength, as well as core stability. You must warm up before starting with this routine and stretch afterwards if you want to get the best results. Workout number one will be performed three times before we progress our clients to workout number two. Starting with 15 to 20 reps of each exercise, we'll be moving from one to the next exercise with minimal rest between. By minimal, we mean two to three seconds. After one full circuit is complete, an optional rest for 60 seconds is included. Then the circuit is repeated two more times. The first exercises are more of a warm-up, or where we start beginners. The last six exercises are for intermediate to advanced clients. We choose and progress these exercises according to the current fitness level of our clients. Owner Lisa Wright has been demonstrating a small warm-up. She's now going to demonstrate the three circuits of the first semi of the series. The first exercise Lisa's performing is a push-up from the knees. Be sure to keep the shoulders down and the navel drawn back in toward the spine. Notice Lisa uses her body as a lever, making it all one move, going down into the push-up and back up. The next exercise Lisa will be performing is a body weight squat. Level one, beginners, using just body weight, keeping the head up and shoulders back. She's not bending at the waist. Weight is in the heels, keeping the knees back behind the toes. For intermediate or advanced exercisers, you can perform the same exercise from the top of an inverted BOSU. Another option is to add resistance to the weight, to the body weight, using some dumbbells. Our third exercise is a jumping jack. Notice Lisa staying light on her feet, landing on the balls of her feet. You can also modify this for a beginner and do a heel jack, which is a little more gentler, not as much impact. The fourth exercise in this circuit is opposite arm and opposite leg raise, working the core. She's gonna take her opposite arm and leg out She's going to squeeze the gluteal and draw the navel back toward the spine, holding for about a second. This completes circuit number one.